Well, hello there, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Ori, and welcome back to EU4 and the Manly Man Campaign, where we are playing as none other than the mighty nation of man. Oh, excuse me. And going for the Empire of Man achievement, in which we need every island in the world, and of course the stipulation is only the islands. So to actually, to properly ensure that, even once we do reconquer man, which we lost quite a while ago at this point, probably 20 years, which does suck, but to ensure that we get all the islands, we are going to move the capital to the New World, because I get the strange feeling like our uh, colonial nations would start colonizing all of this. And Yeah, I want to keep this uh, a true islands-only campaign, and the only way to really do that is to um, move the capital to the New World. So we could move it directly to uh, Eriksfjord first, and then probably to uh, Beothuk, but I'm going to see if we can move it to uh, Beothuk first. Uh, we are getting subsidized by both Denmark and Scotland being absolute badasses, and I don't think there's anything else we really need to talk about. We're getting some cash, we're about to, uh, I don't know if we're going to build up the army much more. I think we should start building up more of a navy at this point, because we really are going to need one. We do have four cogs queued up, which is not too bad overall. But let's get right back into it, shall we? We are spying on Portugal and Spain in an attempt to steal some maps. Yes, we are also paying our debt off. Denmark has canceled the subsidies. That sucks. But we have paid a fair chunk of our debt off. Thanks to uh, those Danish subsidies. I wonder why he canceled them. No, he's not at war. We're still allied with him. We're still allied with France. I'm really tempted to use at least... Because we are going to get some more favors with France at some point. I'm kind of tempted to use these. Well, I don't know yet. I'm still debating on whether or not I want to uh, burn those on trust with France or not. It would be nice. Don't get me wrong. It definitely would be nice to uh, keep France's trust well above 50. But we just don't really have the favors right now. Oh, again? <sighs> We're definitely taking land at this point. I am... I've... Ah. <laughs> Those are my thoughts on uh, the current situation. So, army. Um, we're not putting Para out there. We're going to get uh, Munga Mac... That guy. This guy, our epic conquistador. Uh, yeah, we have troops training in Cork. That's fine. Let's just go. You guys... No, no, you need to hide right now. No, you, you need to hide. Go to Conact. Hide, thank you. Where are you guys headed? The channel? Okay, so I can sneak that ship out. Can we sneak that ship out? I think we can. Yes. Denmark is involved in this. I know that much. We can sneak this out. We are in a war with France right now. So we could use that to our advantage to attempt to attack Sligo and Scotland. But they have a huge tech lead on us right now. They're two mil techs ahead of us. And mil tech 12 is critical to say the least what okay that ship is uh that ship is moving on my orders that's right okay so england has miltech 11 we're about to take miltech 11 and he is landing troops where he is landing troops in cork okay well he can land troops on top of us that's fine we're not i think we will get an extra morale tick here we'll have to check advisors momentarily Actually, let's check this now. Yeah, let's get the morale advisor. That's going to help. Let's see. No, that is. I did not want to use the find feature. So these guys won't land until the 1st of October. So yeah, we're going to have full morale. Okay, they are going to land in uh, Leinster now. So let's go up and occupy Pale so they can't just insta land. That would be awful. Okay, so they have landed here. We will get another month of replenishment. And I think I'm actually just going to go kill this stack right now before England brings any more reinforcements in. Yeah, while while they still have... Um, yeah, while they still don't have a general, let's just go ahead and deal with this English stack real fast. There we go. They do have a general now, but we did still stack wipe them. Denmark is involved in this, which is cool. I'm just not sure what he's really going to be doing other than distracting the English Navy, which would be pretty cool. Now, where's the English army? We've killed 5,000 of it. England still has, I want to say, like, 28k troops floating around somewhere that I'm pretty worried about. We did have to renew a bank loan, unfortunately. It's all good, though. All good. 
I think we do need some more cavalry overall, honestly. Okay, there's... Oh, God. Spain's about to get stack-wiped here by France. Yeah, see, this is why I'm not super concerned about this anymore. Oh, auto man. Auto man. We must improve with you more. I think we can stop spying on Portugal right now. Ottomans have just decided we needed 10 ducats a month in subsidies. 10. Um, is this... Yeah, no, that's a... Tra yeah, no, that's a light and transport fleet. Oh, hey, we can uh, mess with our estates again. That's fine. Let's go ahead and grant Monopoly Charters. Uh, I'm kind of tempted to go over 80 here. Yeah, let's do it. Let's go ahead and seek support of the clergy. We'll establish the New World Missions. Recruit the... Uh, in we'll recruit the minister. Oh, that still didn't get it. We'll get the Inquisitor, too. There's that 150 admin we needed. Uh, additional levies, I don't think we really need them. Uh, I might do, like, one tick of dev in cork. Nah, I think we'll be okay for right now. Yeah, ten ducats a month in subsidies from the Ottomans. What an absolute legend he is. I, like, Auto Man, you are awesome. You are just an absolute beast, Auto Man. Alright, let's get that, let's get that cavalry we needed. Having that second ca unit of cav will be quite helpful. France has canceled the subsidies. That's fine. I'm actually totally fine with that. So now... Yeah, if we had closer Miltech to Scotland and Tyrone, if we had Miltech 12 or like something even equivalent, I would be all for going to war with them right now. I would be all for it. Oh, why? Are you serious? Oh, there's England, and he has Miltec 12. Oh, God. Yeah, I think we need to switch our focus over to Miltec. Oh, and Miltec 12. Let's see exactly what they get. Tactics. This is going to be rough. This is going to be rough. We're outnumbered. They're already there. Damn, we got, they, got, they got here before we could intercept. Hmm... Well, let's see. They're probably going to have to go siege Corker Limerick. That will be a defensive battle for us, which is a lot, which is better. Better, I would say. That's a 16 stack, though. Uh, yeah, we're going to have to make peace way sooner than I want to, just because otherwise England's going to kill us, especially once they get the war goal, because I think they are going to go straight to, to the Midlands. Yep, I knew it. No, they're going for Limerick. I can't get military access through Sligo because we hate each other. Um, we could get that colonial. And eh, no. We're not even getting the study tech bonus right now. Okay, so England is sieging Limerick. Hmm. We just need France to basically win a couple battles real fast. That's really what we need to happen. As soon as we can get to that white piece, I think we'll have to, honestly. Yeah, ooh, walls breached. Excuse me. No, no. Defensiveness edict. Slow that down. Of tea and sugar. Yeah, I definitely don't want to engage England here, though, because he has that Miltech 12. Uh, can we get... Hmm. 14 reasons. Hmm. I am going to repay this loan, thanks to the Ottomans. Any loans we can get paid back, honestly, are going to be nice right now. I think France is... Hmm, what is France up to? Okay, so England... Uh... Hmm. They're landing more cannons. That's not great. Let's see, what is France up to? Yeah, because if we lose the capital here, we're going to have a rough time, honestly. Yep. Hmm. Well, you have three siege. Where are they headed? Let's see if we can get it back. Ah, we didn't get there for the monthly tick. Up oh, there's England engaging. That's not good. Oh, shit. This is bad. This is bad. So we can't get peace because they have our capital now, and we're about to get wrecked by England here. 
I don't care about Deep Martian's opinion. Oh my god. Yep, England landed his whole army here. We're dead. Damn it. Well, that sucks. We're going to have to count on France to kick Spain's ass for us then. Uh, I want Cork to have more trade power. Obviously, we're going to put the defensiveness edict on here as well. I think we'll put it on everywhere and just stall. That's dev cost. Damn. I think we'll just try and stall as long as we can. Which is not going to be very much longer at this point. Damn it, Spain. Oh, this is so frustrating. Like, Spain is having his dream, the dream Spain game right now. He got the inheritance. He got a random PU on England. France, go kill that damn Spanish army. Ah. Oh. Seriously? Well, that sucks. We're saving the fleet. Whatever we do. I don't care. We're just going to go save the fleet at this point. Run. Run, little fleet. Go save yourself. Uh, run away. Do we have an admiral? No, we don't even have the Diplo for one because we just took Diplo tech. I might as well repay that loan. Random church aspect. No. Okay, well, that sucks. We just lost some... Uh, uh, we just lost an as No, wait, we just lost church power, not an aspect of faith. We do have all three of our aspects of faith, though, which I'm okay with. Yep, this sucks. You want white piece, Spain? It's gonna be a while before we can even get a white piece now, because France is gonna have to do some serious work for us. Whatever, this colony will be done pretty quickly, though, and I think we may end up just, like, being forced to migrate there, basically. Which really does suck. Yeah, this campaign has been interesting to say the least. <laughs> uh... Hey, look, Denmark's finally bringing some troops here. Wow. Denmark finally brought some troops down. Wait, where are the Danish? Where is the Danish army? Oh, they're going to... Okay, they're going to the holding... They're going to Spain's Italian holdings. That's not actually that helpful. Spain's about to lose that battle. I am going to repay another loan. Let's see. Noble counselors. We can get the burgers loyal. Yeah, we might as well. It's going to piss the nobles off, but whatever. Burgers do gain plenty of influence, but at this point, uh, yeah, I don't think that really matters. 19 reasons on a white piece. Come on, France. I literally can't do anything right now. So, France, it's all on you, man. I'm firing the advisor, even. Can I revoke Cork? Nope, I don't own it. Oh, well. Come on, France. Give me that white piece. 20 reasons. Yay, Denmark is occupying some Spanish land. Uh, Spain is moving over there, though. Yeah, this is going to be tough to get a white piece at this point, even. This is not going to be easy, especially once Desmond falls. Because it is about to fall. Well? Let's see. It appears France has decided they want to chase Spain into Italy. Siege of Desmond is over. 34 reasons for a white piece. Um, I'm not going to that to hell with it. We'll support dissidents in Scotland. Why not? I don't really care at this point. <laughs> uh, it appears the Danish army got wrecked. Pretty hard from the looks of it. Yep, Danish army just got annihilated. So Denmark has no troops, really. That's useful. Sweden's not being helpful because they're disloyal. Huh. Well, this is bad. Ooh, I don't want to do that. No, we'll take the autonomy. Where is our inflation? 10. Fine, we'll spend 75 admin. Bring it down. Oh, hey, Commonwealth. Oh, yeah, Commonwealth's a thing. Let's see. Who else hates Spain? Because this is getting real damn annoying. Auto man, please. 
Just please. Oh my, um, yeah, you rivaled France, never mind. Let's improve relations with the common blob. Steal maps from Spain because we can. Um, sure, what do we want to steal? Northeast? Does he have the Northeast explored? 22 provinces. I'd still rather steal like the South Atlantic from him, honestly. But we can't, we don't have a navy down there, and I'm not risking our navy by sending it down there. Sure, let's just, you know what, let's get like Central America, maybe. Let's see if we can. Uh, Central America, nope. Caja. Could get some provinces up in the Hud, could get some knowledge on provinces in the Hudson Bay, but nah. Let's just get Northeast. 22 provinces. Okay. So that's not too bad. It's not like we're really going to do much with that information anyway, but you never know. We're going to keep improving relations with the Common Blob in, in, a, in a hope that uh, Common Blob will uh, give us an alliance that we desperately need. Come on, France. Go see your fort back, man. Come on. This is costing us war score, damn it. I know I can't do anything because I'm fully occupied right now. This is stupid. Uh, well, the English troops are fully over in um, Denmark now, which is a good sign. The, France should get this siege of Breda here pretty quick, or uh, Den Haag, excuse me, pretty quickly, which is good. Spain, do you want out of this? Maybe, I don't know. We'll see what this, do this uh, siege does to the war score. Hopefully it falls pretty quick. Yes, I know our war exhaustion's through the roof. Do I care? No. Manx Particularists. You know what? That's fine if Manx Particularists rise up. I am completely fine with that. Nah, we're just gonna sit on this money. For right now, we're just gonna sit on it. I will repay that loan, though. Okay, 3% war score. Oh, 10 reasons on a white piece. Come on! France, go get your fort back. You have Spain full you have the Spanish lowlands fully occupied. Here, go take this too, France. How about that? Is that more helpful if I give you some orders, some direction? Like we're at war with Spain. Go siege Spain. <laughs> I can't believe I have to like spell it out for the AI. We can build some stuff up in Eric's Fjord. Let's not and say we did. How about that? Our navy has survived out here. You know what? We can actually build boats out here in Eric's Fjord. We're going to build a heavy. We might as well. Look at that. 1,600 days. It's going to take... No, no, no. If it's going to take that long, it's not even worth it. And that's almost certainly because of our rebels. Or our uh, war exhaustion, excuse me. Nope. Oh, whatever. Yep, burgers. Not like I had much of an option there. I will just burn the 100 stab. How do we curtail them? Stab at least one. Burger's influence lower than 60. So they do have some stuff dropping off in the not too distant future. We'll probably... I'm, I'm just going to revoke um, Cork anyway if we do retain Cork. Okay, 5%. Spain, do you want out? No, 16 I mean, if you're going to go siege, if you're going to take armies around France, go siege, like, yeah, go siege that. Denmark's getting occupied. Yay, Denmark, make peace. You're costing me war score, damn it. There's a hastily erected Castilian army right there, or Spanish army. Okay, that did fall. Castile? Yes. Get out, dude. Get the hell out of my country. Stop attacking me, damn it! France, I love you. Stop attacking me, god damn it. Enough. Bye, Diplo. Oh, god. Alright, let's go ahead and revoke Cork. Because we can do that now. There we go. That's fine. The nobles are super pissy. That's because there's another estate in power. Yeah, that did bring them down. We'll repay a loan. We're going to go ahead and boost up stability once there's printing press. And we should be able to curtail the burgers. Influence lower than 60. Okay. 
So we do have to wait for at least one other thing to fall off, which is going to be probably merchants and administration in seven years. Okay. Well, we're alive. I mean... Uh... No! I can't fight Scotland. No! Ah, oh, Denmark. Can we straight up move the capital here? Yeah. Yeah, we could absolutely move the capital to Newfoundland. Um, no, we'd have to go to... Yeah, we ha we'll have to move it to Eriksfjord first. But we are definitely getting our capital the hell out of here. Uh, oh, hey. Hey, I just got Grand Banks Fisheries. That's cool. These all get Grand... Oh, all these provinces get Grand Banks Fisheries. That's, so that's actually a really good modifier. Okay, so that is done being colonized. Um, I think our next... Let's see, what's the next highest dev colony here? Hmm. I mean, I'd love it if we could just jump down to Havana, but I think that's asking for trouble in all honesty. I think that really is asking for trouble. Um... I mean, we might as well colonize this. That's fine. Because we have Grand Banks Fisheries now. Oh, I didn't... Oh, God. I did not mean to do that. Uh, I meant to do that. Damn it. Well, that sucks. Rip admin. On that note, though, we're going to go ahead and call it an episode. So, as always, I would like to thank you for tuning in and watch spending a little part of your day here. It is greatly appreciated. If you're enjoying the series, please do remember to drop a like down below as it really helps the channel out. And subscribe for more Grand Strat... Oh, excuse me. And subscribe for more Grand Strategy content in the future. If you would like to become a patron and help support the channel monetarily, it is very much appreciated. Please do take a moment to check out the Patreon. Link is in the description. And if you would like to join a growing community over on Discord, there is also a link to that down below. As always, my name is Ori, I do hope you have a fantastic day, and we will catch you in the next one.